An electric performance by John Batiste, who had the most Grammy nominations and won five awards, including a big one, Album of the Year. Fort Worth's Leon Bridges was shut out despite a pair of nominations, but a Fort Worth photographer has a special connection to both artists. Baby, 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 I'm coming home. When Fort Worth's Leon Bridges saw his career take off in 2015 with his first hit song, Coming Home, much of that video was filmed in his friend's Fort Worth home with that same friend co-starring in the video. I really loved my friend and I loved dancing and singing with him and I just thought he was beautiful and so we would go have these mini field trips and adventures and even we didn't realize we were building a brand. Rambo Elliott saw Bridges rise to stardom through a unique lens. After all, she was part of it becoming his official photographer on tour. This label comes to my house and is like, we haven't hired a photographer in your capacity since the 60s. Do you understand this work? Can you continue this work? Do you know where you are? And I was like, y'all are asking me if I'm smart. Y'all are asking me if I know boundaries. Y'all are asking me if I know how to work every minute I'm standing. And the answer is, yeah, I can do that and work relentlessly she has. Rambo's work has been featured on all of Bridges' album covers except one, and in countless magazines. If we're in the same room, something about the two of our minds can make really iconic dancing, breathing work, you know? And even album two, I mean, I just, we shot it in that room, right over there on some red paper. He wore the gloves from my wedding night on the back of the cover. He's just an iconic person, and I just want to make sure that the people that I love are represented like high art. Grammy nominations were announced, and the artist with the most nomination, the most honored artist this year with 11 nominations, is Mr. John Batiste, right there. Many know John Batiste as the band director for The Late Show with Stephen Colbert on CBS. Rambo knows him as another dear friend she met in Fort Worth. One of his album covers also one of her masterpieces. Just a snapshot of her connection to two of the biggest stars at this year's award show. I'm just immeasurably proud. Like, they have such gifts, and their gifts really help the world. When I move my body just like this, I don't know why, but I feel like this. Both of their gifts just really help the culture feels celebrated and safe. I think they make other men feel safe to be vulnerable and be open. Like, I'm just really proud of them. To be proud of them, Rambo also has to be really proud of herself. As the profiles of Bridges and Batiste have grown, so has hers. It's nice to remember that my work has been widespread. It has been going everywhere. I just don't slow down enough to see it. A portrait of Rambo's world, her collection of vintage telephones in honor of family members who worked for Southwestern Bell, her calling to amass countless Stetson hats, her wall of dead roses never wanting to get rid of one because they were all given to her by her husband. Every article that's ever been written about me has been like, quirky Fort Worth photographer, <laughs> eccentric. I'm like, I get it, y'all. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I get it. Uh, the message is clear. You're not wrong. Even the way she got her name has special meaning. I'm the last of the girls. There's no more Rambos after this. I'm making my family name my first name. And so when I got married, I had it legally changed to Rambo Elliott. And then when I get in magazines, it doesn't say Rambo Elliott. It says Rambo. It's my sisters. It's my cousins. It's my grandmas. It's my single mom. It's every single human who helped our family get right here gets represented with Rambo. No one has gotten here alone. None of us. Cause when I look up to the stars, I know exactly who we are. Hoping for a life more sweeter. With Leon Bridges and John Batiste, both in Vegas for the 2022 Grammys, you can rest assured a part of them is also back in Fort Worth. I'm just grateful. I'm grateful for them. I'm grateful for me. Like, they won. Yes, they did, and Rambo's a winner, too. Now a world-renowned photographer, and the world is her canvas. I mean, she's uh, 
very interesting. And I kept saying, you are so interesting. And I meant that in a positive way because she's so free flowing. She, she's like one of these people who says, I got a goal. I'm going to go out there and get it. I don't care what people think. It's, you know, I'm a little bit envious of people who are like that sometimes. Like, I wish I had that little bit of that artistic ability. It's really incredible to see. Their minds definitely work in a creative way. Yeah, that is for sure. It does.